Hi, I'm Alexander Peratoner, a student at ETT Buonarroti Trento, and today I'm going to show you how to set up a virtual background in Google Meet. The first thing to do is obviously to open Meet. In this case, we're using a test meeting. Once the page has loaded, you can see there are different options, one to mute the microphone, one to enable or disable our webcam, and the third one, uh, which was uh, introduced uh, in the last version of Chrome, is to change our background. If you don't see this option, you either have to update Chrome, or maybe you have to enable hardware acceleration inside the settings. To do this, open a new tab, go to the settings, on the left, under advanced system, make sure you have this option enabled. If we click on this button, we can either blur our background or apply a default image. We can also upload an image from our disk using this plus icon. Your teacher should give you these two backgrounds with all the logos you'll need. There are two versions, one with free space on the left and one on the right. In this case, we're using the one with free space on the left. As you can see, the image looks mirrored, but for all the other people inside the meeting, it will look normal and they will be able to read it. So don't worry about it. This built-in function is really fast, but doesn't look good on the borders. And if you are not running the latest version and don't have this option, you'll need to install an extension. The extension that I have found is working well. It's called Visual Effects for Google Meet. We can install it by simply clicking on Add to Chrome. Once the extension has been installed, we can go to our meeting, reload the web page, and once inside of the meeting, you will have this tiny window on the side. If we scroll down to the green screen window, we can upload a background. It's now loaded and we can enable it. If we now check our webcam, you can see we are visible. The border is looking a little bit better, but it's a bit laggy. You now know how to use the virtual backgrounds on Google Meet. You could either use the built-in function, which doesn't look good on the borders, or you can install an extension for Google Chrome, which could sometimes be a bit laggy. This is everything I had to show you. Thanks for watching.